distribution now, then there has to be. The staff that are around a wildlife park are unsure when these little guys will be able to see. Like product. Product. Like product. Product. That's an innovative product that's going to be it's taken nine long years, but teachers and principals alike are finally endorsing the Secondary Schools Assessment System, NCEA. Along with the support though, there are still issues the Ministry of Education and the teachers are working on. Scott Milligan explains. It's a system that's taken some time to get used to, but for many secondary school staff, they're now feeling it's an idea that's worked. I think that because teachers believe in it and they know that it's a much fairer way of assessing students, they have been very receptive to that change. NCEA was introduced in 2002. Those who worked with it say one of the biggest challenges was convincing parents. Really the um, education of the public has probably been one of the most problematic aspects of it. They believe they now had the nine-year-old system working well for students. It's a really good way of mixing and matching um, the qualifications that best suit the students. And a sampling of students from one college would seem to support that. So it can kind of help you in your future and show that you're a harder worker than maybe other people? Because it allows for academic differentiation between the people that have only just passed and the people that have actually really tried. For all that, there are still some concerns. Moderation is definitely one of the stickier issues around NCEA. The NZQA moderation system assesses teachers' marks to make sure they're fair, but there are still problems. NZQA Deputy CEO Bali Huck said last year's moderation system was 76% accurate, up 4% on 2008's figures. The Ministry of Education is not happy, however, and Tolly told me, I am very disappointed that there hasn't been greater improvement in these rates. This is an issue which I'm focused on, and I've asked NZQA to explain why these results aren't as good as they should be. Teachers argue they need firmer guidelines to help decrease the gap. A lot of teachers, when they send their work in for moderation, they send in the things or the assessments that they're least confident about, so they're actually asking for some feedback. NZQA is working on the rates with the ministry hot on their tail. Scott Milligan, Metro News.